In this quick tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make a quick DITA book map. So the first thing you're going to need are some DITA topics. So I'm going to make a couple here. And for the sake of time, I'm just going to save this as topic A. And I'm going to save this again. I'm just going to hit Escape FA. That's Save As. I'm going to call this topic B. And Escape FA again. I'm going to call this topic C. So now I have three topics that I'm working with. And I'm going to assemble these into a book. So in order to create a book, I need to come here to File, New, and actually create what's called a DITA book map. I could actually create a map too, but a book map has a few more features that I like. So in here, I can go ahead and add my books by clicking on this Insert Child. The thing is, it's grayed out. You want to make sure that you select the book name itself, and from here you can insert these topic references. I can come to the href and select my topic. Hit OK. And now I'm going to go ahead and select the other topics as well. And last but not least, my last topic. I'm skipping over a lot of things here. This again, a quick tutorial. I'm going to move this out so that these are all at the same level. And I'll probably also want to edit this book title. The way I would do that is I would get into this switch document view and from there I would be able to change this and rename this. But for this example, I'm going to go ahead and just save this book. Uh, this is actually a, a DITA map. And there's some other options in here that you can see. But for now, I'm going to save this as a DITA map. I'm just going to call this um, my book. And now I could potentially just come up here and save as a PDF and this is going to generate this output. Another pretty cool thing that FrameMaker has is I can change this by doing a file save as and instead of choosing a DITA map I can come in here and choose book 2017 with FrameMaker components. It's pretty cool. I'll leave it the same name. You'll see why it's pretty cool in just a second here. And what it does is it generates a brand new book based off of my DITA map with all the pieces that I could possibly need to make a book, including the topics that I made. A list of figures, list of tables, and an index, and a whole thing. All these pieces, of course, can be changed. And from here, I could generate a PDF just like normal. And there you have it. I've just made a PDF based off of a DITA map. And if I scroll up to the very top of the document, you'll see that it has this pre-built content. And I have links in my table contents, just as I would expect. To learn more about DITA and FrameMaker 2017, contact us at lumenbright.com.